ideal metallics we are metallics because we are addicted to maths let's continue with part 2 of place values addition with carry over and subtraction with borrow if you have some confusions here in this video please have a look of my previous video part 1 link of which is there in description box let's go through some examples of addition subtraction to understand carryover and borrow in detail. Now let's see the number 108. What's the breakup here? 100, 0, 10 and 8, 1. Exactly. And this 100 if you see is nothing but 10, 10 uh, which is equal to 100 ones. My each 10 correspond to 10 ones and corresponding to every 10 I have 100 ones. Now if I add 3 ones to it, what's happening? 3 ones to 8 ones and we know that whenever I have set of 10 ones, I have to replace it by 1 tens. And this one tens actually being two digit comes on my second place. So what I am left with? One I am left with. And my ten ones formed one ten. And what was this? This was my carry over. And this one tens has come on tens place. And we have got. 1 10 and 100 is here present as it is. Now let us see concept of subtraction also in this example only. Now this number is triple 1 and I have to subtract 3 from it. Can I take 3 1's from here? No. But it is available within the system. Now I will go to tens and say can you lend me two ones because I have to subtract three ones from me. He will say I can't give you exactly two ones. I have one ten will come to this place which will become nothing but ten ones. So how many ones I have now? 11 ones. With 11 ones, I will subtract 3 ones. How many ones are left now? 8. And this one 10 came here. So this is also gone. So how many 10s here now? 0. And 100 as it is. So when this one 10 went to ones place and became 10 ones, what was it? It was nothing but borrow. So we have discussed borrow in subtraction and carry over in addition. Let us do with few more examples to clear the concept fully. Suppose I am adding 256 to 45. 256 means 200, 5 tens, 6 ones and 45 means Four tens, five ones. Now, if I add six ones with five ones, I will be getting ten ones and one one. And this ten one will get replaced with one ten, and it will come here. So now, how many ones are left here with me? I am left with one ones only. Now here, how many tens I have got? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Again, 10 tens. And 10 tens get replaced with 100. And this 100 will come at 100 place. Now, how the, all these 100 are, all these 10 tens are inside this 100. Now how many tens are left here? I am left with no tens. And 
how many hundreds? At hundreds place now, 300. So we see, we got carry over from here with one tens. With tens place, we got carry over here with 100. In short, we have done 256 plus 45. 6 ones plus 5 ones was 1 ones. 1 tens got carry forward. 6 tens, 4 tens became 10 hundred. No 10 was left on this place. And I got carry forward and I got answer as 301. Now let us see example of subtraction also with same numbers. How borrowing happens. Now if I have to subtract 45 from 301. At one's place I have only one coin. How can I take away 5 coin from one coin? It will go to tens place. Please, one ten come to at once place, making it ten ones. But zero tens we are present here, so tens place will go to hundred place. Saying, please borrow us one hundred, and one hundred when will come at tens place will become ten tens. Out of these ten tens, we have to send one tens to ones place also. These one tens will become nothing but 10 ones and when I take away 5 one, uh, ones from it, I, this I have taken away. I will be left with how many ones? Uh, how many ones? It will be 6 one. and here I got 10 tens from 100 place. 1 ten I have sent to ones place. So how many tens are left here now? 9 tens. And from 9 tens, I have to take away how many tens? I have to take away 4 tens. And I will be left with how many how many tens? I will be left with 5 tens. Giving me 5 at tens place. And here, 3 hundreds were present. And I have taken away 100. Leaving behind 200 only. Hence, when I subtract. 45 that is I take away 45 from 301 I will be getting 256 tell me if it is clear or not if you have any doubts please write in comment box please subscribe for the channel for more such videos do practice feel maths enjoy maths this is Manika Maheshwari signing off. Bye-bye.